What's up? And welcome back to another video of BB Token Gaming. In this video, we're cracking open a UFO booster box. I went to this uh, release event uh, in Monterey. Uh, I forgot what it's called, but it's related to the Monterey Casters Association. I think it's called. But they're really nice people. They're pretty cool. And I plan on going back. But we're going to get into this box because I've been waiting since yesterday to open it. So. All right, I think it's working now. All right, cool. My camera froze and I uh, had to fix it real fast. But that's why you probably see that little cutout right there. But yeah, I saw like we did, there was like a little, um, I guess like a draft. I guess they call them Blitz in Mia MetaZoom, but you get like a release event deck and then you get six boosters. I got like the most shittiest boosters I could possibly get. There was nothing in there and I had this. It was like an or it was a what was it? It was light and um actually I have it right here. It was light and oh got forest. And I got like zero light, zero forest. If I was playing dark though, I would have been set. I got hella dark cards. <laughs> got artifacts for dark. Hella shit. But I think I'm gonna cut all these open. No fucking idea. Yeah, okay. And then we'll just get into the Alright, I'm gonna use these MetaZoo UFO fucking sleeves that I got yesterday in the spellbook. If you haven't seen them yet, they're pretty clean. <clears throat> yeah, I'll probably be smoking in this video too. And it's not gonna be a short video. I'm not gonna fix it. Maybe I'll try it. Actually, I'm gonna get the cards. There's a little, there's a little button right here. All right, let's do this, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, to the 13 viewers I have. <laughs> Appreciate y'all. And if you haven't seen the Arbor Pennies pack, I'll show you real fast. Bam. I want this little bird hollow. I think it's nasty. I was seeing, I see, when I was at the little event, I seen these dudes playing just beforehand, but it was pretty funny because they both were playing Lightning. It was a mirror match, but everybody plays fucking clutch, dude. The fucking Dean Bell clutch, fucking Dean Bells, like, I mean, it's, it's a good deck, you know, but, like, it's fucking out there. It's overrated, dude. Get some originality, homies. Like, for real, for real. All you guys make the same decks. It's sort of fucking stupid, if you ask me. But that's just my opinion. Opinions like assholes, every guy on right? I also met Meta Man at the fucking event too. That's pretty cool. He's actually a lot different in person than he is in his videos. Dude's fucking a lot. Like he's, I thought he was pretty cool. I don't really like his. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, he's he's just cool. Just put it like that. He, he, but he's a lot different. It's like that. You would not expect him to be how he is in person than he is on his channel. I guess it's the whole persona thing, but he's chill as fuck. He's cool, dude. I wish I could have played him though, because he was playing the little, the little event too. But I think because he came late, he lost like two or something. He just got him lost him by default. Check out the art on this one, man. Look at the little fucking. Look at the little fucker. Cowboy fucking T Rex. Mm, 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 mm. Man, man, you ain't washed up, bro. You're still playing medicine, dog. What are you talking about? Washed up, my ass. Well, a couple of those packs are heavy as fuck, dude. I don't know if that's good or not. I don't know some of the fucking. Is this because some of the cards require more print or more ink than the other ones? Or... It's because it's full hollow. I don't know. Speak it how it is, yo. My favorite saying, if you don't like the way it sounds out loud, change that shit, dude.
All right, we're gonna get into the cracking of these fucking packs, yo. Actually, we're just gonna open them up because they're already fucking ripped open. So, all right, we got Burnout, Graves, Roswell Re Recreation. Is it good lighting? Can y'all see this shit? Or should I fucking fix it? That's all. We got the Seven Thunders. Alien Bigfoot, eye for an eye. Actually, I, this is actually a really good play. Eye for an eye. Perfect for counters. Perfect. Just destroy the whole ship. I actually used that. Then we got a, gri a griddle grease peat. Nice. Did they steal this from fucking... It looks like they stole it from fucking uh, Disney, dude. That's hella funny. I mean, I didn't say that, but... It looks like that's straight up from Disney, dude. The little Porky the Pig. Where am I lying? I'll show you. This is Porky the Pig straight the fuck up, dude. A more animated version. His name's even Pete, bro. Come on now, it's like fucking Mickey Mouse is that sworn enemy, that big dude. The big rat. Alright, second pack, baby. Um, tell you two separate beasts, then deal 25. Oh, rock, the rock base, uh, the rock deck's gonna get vicious too. Shit. Kodiak dinosaur or Kodiak? Yes, Kodiak dinosaur. Whirling winters. Oh, another full hollow. We got a frozen rain orb. And a spirit infusion as the rare. Token, we're gonna start separating these in the hollows. Two full hollows so far. I hope I get one of them fucking god bosses. I've been seeing everybody get like 34 full hollows and shit. I'm like, what the fuck? But I'm also thinking that they give you like better cards or when you buy them on release. I think those boxes they send out are the better boxes. Just saying, I've been noticing that. Most of the time when people bought the earlier boxes, the ones that people pull the good shit out of. They all, the, the first few boxes that came out wilderness, dude pulled all the tickets. Yeah. Just observation, yeah. This is a cool looking card. Just the sky snake. Yeah, if you I mean if you want to see the cards, y'all can always pause and read. Oh, this is cool. Dwarf Star. I love the artwork and have this card. I got this card a reverse, and the symbol on the top was blue. It was a fucking misprint. It's fucking dope. Top symbol up here is blue. I'll show you guys. Oh no, dude, another fucking full hollow. And his name is Wankin. We're just gonna call him Wankin. Alright, Wankin Yan. We're gonna call him Wankin. Cause he be Wankin. And then you may fatigue this artifact at any time. Oh, it's a white and fucking. Oh, wow. If I would have pulled this for that deck, that would have been cool. I'm gonna keep that to the side just because we need some of those right now. We don't have full hollows yet or any of them yet. So we'll keep those to the side. Leave this full hollow up, yo. That's three full hollows so far. And this thing does. Let's see what this thing does. I don't know. If you contract, you may call like a bird, take 50 damage. If you do this BC under the Abrina Awaken, you can, if you're destroyed, generate 2 uh, electric aura. It does 10 damage, so I, it's called the Offering. Has flight, and I don't know what that symbol is. Must be a new one. I'll have to check that out. And he cost 1 to contract. So it's a, it's just mana. You fucking just attack and fucking get mana. It's a little mana bird. That's pretty cool. More ramp. What the fuck does it what is What does electric need more ramp for? What does lightning need more around for? Does that make any sense, y'all? It's one of the fucking better uh, decks in the meta, and they're giving it better cards. Alright, sure. Sam Shussy baseball bat. Hey, what the fuck? Energy boom? That's just a dope looking card, dude. I want that in full hollow. We got static halt and a revert. Oh, another full hollow. And evil twins is the rare. Dude, what the fuck? Hey, hey, hey. I'm, I, it's looking pretty good right now, boys. <clears throat> it's looking pretty good. It's looking pretty fucking saucy. I'll just throw the package there and I'll pick them up later. Alright, and so there's a, there's a cosmic deck that you get in there. And you damn near get like fucking just like an army of these guys. And I had an army of these little Ludwig things. If I pull them, I'll show you. But they're pretty nasty. You just stack them up with each other. And they do. Uh, I did up to like, and it was like 55 damage. And if you have more than three on the field, they gain invisibility so they can't be targeted either. 
Another full hollow? What? Oh, we're getting some good shit. Okay. Okay. Look at that. Van Meter Visitor. I've never seen this one. That's because I haven't really watched the videos. I've been fucking saving the little uh, sneak peeks and people have been opening their box. I opened one and I seen the dude get like, I seen two of them. And dudes like got 34 and 32 for all. I was like, God damn, bro. So right now we're sitting at six or five. Five out of five, yo. It's looking pretty saucy. And then as I say that, we're going to get like nothing but reverses now. Just shut the fuck up, Tanner. Open your packs. Gosh, gravity shift, look at that shit. All beasties without flight, game flight until the end of this turn. All beasties, you may contract this at any time. Hey, bro, it's a counter for fucking, for that fucking thing in water. Oh, shit. Water, you're, sh you're, you're fucked. You're gonna, you're dead. The water's fucked now. Oh, man. That staple one, that's gonna, if not, side deck for sure and almost everybody's fucking deck. That's gonna be disgusting. Oh, and also, so I'll tell you guys about my looks. Oh, Jesus, another one. A full fucking hollow, baby. Gosh. And we got Hatman. I'm not too impressed until we pull a full hollow Hatman. So fuck Hatman for now. All right? We won't look at that guy until we get a full hollow. But look at this bitch. Infinite token, baby. Look at that. Or infinite power. My bad. You guys can freeze. I don't feel like reading. I'm going to read all my cards later. <laughs> I'm going to look at all of them. So... Y'all, I froze. I put it there. Y'all can freeze and read. I don't want to make the video too long, so. Oh, this thing, some dude actually used this. He had two of these in his deck. It was pretty funny. Mike the Headless Chicken. Is that supposed to be from Meta Z? You think that's Mike? You know, he's referencing himself because he's fucking done what he's doing? Or he's going ham or what? He's just, just working? What is this? Forest friends. Cause he's fucking going ham, dude. And it's more than worth it. Good job, Mike, brother. Good fucking job. Let me tell you. You're doing fucking better than any other TCG has done in fucking I don't know how long. You're doing that. You're doing as better as good as them in you know, I don't know. Ten times faster. It's fucking nuts, bro. You're fucking insane. And you're making ten times more money too though, so <laughs> get it, brother. Get it. Make that money, bro. Shit. Oh, look at that fucking Flatted embers. And you get more, more. These are like fucking, uh, they're making more uh, instant spells. That is so fucking cool. You can contract these at any time. And then another full hollow. We got Omen Street Orb and we got an Iridescent Orb. Uh, whatever. And some tokens and auras. The tokens and auras in this set are actually really saucy. I'm probably going to use most of them. Uh, I'm going to switch them out for the ones I have in my decks now. I think we got a good box. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate you, Doc. And thanks, um... The... God damn it, I just said their names too. Jesus. What a tard. When I remember, I'll tell you. Oh, yeah. Monterey Casters Association. Appreciate y'all. And it's hella funny. This is the first reverse we got, but you know, it's alright. We won't, we won't get all better yet. Um... They're actually really fucking friendly. And the dude, he was, like, he was like, hey, you want to pick a box? Which one calls out for you? And then I was like, hey, bro, you just picked me a box. And he actually picked me a box that had a fucking fire ass card in it. It's on that spell book video that I just um, posted. And I'll have it in the link somewhere. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Where's my hand at? There. There you go. So we got some more. We got a Crocodino. Cute little guy. At the end of the turn, this BC did not current attack, awaken it. So at the beginning of one turn, he put him to the field and he gets he gets fucking unfatigued. He gets awakened. And then the attack deals 10 plus damage, uh, or no. Deals 40 plus damage to BC has cleared as a defender. So he does even more damage. You want to keep him as a defender, boys and girls. So we got Basking in the Sunlight, Energy. We got Spirit Shadow. In the second reverse, Saber Tiger. This card is fucking disgusting. All the frost cards they made. Water cards. Oh my god. So I, almost, I got my ass whooped by the frost one. Frost electric. That shit was disgusting. Fucking nasty. We got two reverses. And we might get a little better now. We're going to keep these over here. They don't belong with the full hollows. Let me, put my, I gotta move my pals. Sorry, 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 sorry. 
Still a little hectic over there. I should have probably cleaned up this stuff. I thought I did, but that's no idea. I'm trying to pull a Foo Fighters on one of those, uh, the fucking, uh, I think it's from the Boss Tangle, what I think it's in there. Another Blood of Embers, good looking card. We got a Polybus. Polybius? How do you say this name? Polybius? Polybius. There we go. Sorry, I'm retarded. I mean, I can't, shouldn't say that. I'm editing it out. My bad. <laughs> you see it? Did I? Yeah. Well, fuck it. I'm going to say retarded. I'm not referencing a person. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Um, do you have scissors? It does. And we got another full hollow. This one is an artifact. It's for rock and ice, I think, or earth. Let me check. I need to turn my big light on. That'll be good. This is uh, water. Water and earth. That's just a great combo. I should have just looked at the picture. Great card, too. So we're going, we're back to the full hollows again, which is fucking awesome. This, can we get a full follow? A full, uh, full, uh, la, 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 la. damn, I'm tired, yo. Foo Fighters. Jesus, tongue twisted like a mother. That's right, this is not a fucking kid's channel. I, I'll be cussing. So if you're under the age and your mom's gonna get mad, you shouldn't be watching my shit, dude. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Keep watching, brother. <laughs> I'll teach you some shit. <laughs> Look at that in the full hollow. We got a mini T Rex. This is the one I was talking about. I actually wanted to pull this too. This is a very fucking cute card. We got a little dinosaur with his fucking little hat and his little boots. And a little dinosaur next to him. That's so cute. That's a big ass biohydrant. Check that shit. That was so cute, right? Oh, okay. Right, with the little boots and the little. Have you seen a little robot? Alright. <laughs> Alright. Um, you know, see, or should I refocus? That's good. Uh, one guess. We got Traspinger. Um, blue jet strike. This is the destroy. Whoa, destroy beast with flight, baby. Oh, man. <laughs> y'all, lightning better be careful, y'all. Destroy it um, until end of turn. Active cash is next turn. I think that snowing is active. Target BC and cash loses 20 life points. And another artifact we're here taking our putting all all to the side because we're going to use those for our decks. Pretty sure we're not going to pull a full set. Oh, we only need two of each, right? So we might pull a full set of most of them. This box. So we got two of them. Um, we got two of two so far. So let's see if we can get a little more. On the Shaw Terror Pigeon Arena, deal 10 damage and for each beast and artifact in the arena for each terror destroyed. Nice board wipe, yeah. Earth has some board wipes now. Keeping that to the side for the Earth deck, because that is disgusting. And you can activate this page at any time, more, more fucking uh, instance. Target artifact is dealt 50 damage. Infoil suit, I'm not reading that. Y'all can read that. Okay. Um, call the storm. Search your spell book for two beasts, uh, two spell, uh, blah, 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 lightning beasts for each with an aura cost of four or less and the same name. Place them in the arena, awaken. This can place them. Oh, okay. Snowing is considered active until the end of turn. At the end of this turn, send one of them chosen beasts to limbo. I don't like that. Well, I mean that's pretty cool, I guess. But like, I don't know. They're making a. They're making thunder or lightning like way too fucking OP, bro. Wait until. I, oh, another full hollow though. We got another Lincoln. <laughs> Oh, it's Wankin, not Wankin. Well, we're calling him Wankin. That's his fucking name, right? Wankin. Wankin the bird, because he be Wankin. See, look. Wank. This is fucking weak. Uh, we'll throw that over there, though. Yeah, I'm going to be smoking. I don't know. These are my cards, anyways. I'm not selling my cards. I'm collecting all my fucking cards, so. I'm going to smoke while I make my video. You know what I'm saying? Oh, my God. I cut a card. I actually cut a card this time. I'm not playing. But it was just this card. <laughs> so it's okay. Oh man, this poor card. First card first fucking a UFO card cut on this channel, yo. Look at that. I bet I bet nobody's gonna do that. <laughs> Nobody. 
<laughs> fucking bad boy gaming does that shit all the time. No something something open on the channel. It's like on on YouTube. It's like, dude. <laughs> hey, he ain't lying though. He ain't lying though. He does the most magic gathering of almost anything. So, and he's more than got the fucking bragging rights for surely. Can't even disrespect that motherfucker. This I tried to use this. This is good. If, this is great if you're playing like um. So for example, you're playing like with decks people you've made yourself like homebrews, but. If you're playing at a fucking tournament where you're you're going off luck and you're hoping that they get an artifact from packs, it was, this is the dumbest fucking card. Bye. This is like the dumbest fucking card to put in my deck. What? Sad dude. Um. So yeah, this is great. This is this is a great staple for like um if you're a competitive um for real for real because most people are gonna use artifacts and this stops their artifacts. For one. So don't show, you know, think about that, peoples. Then we got Uso, U S O, which I call it U S O, and another fucking full hollow mother. Sheesh, that's what I'm talking about. That's, that's what I'm talking about, baby. They're showing me some love, but then also, I was watching another video and dude did make sense. So um, since like I've been seeing, like I said, I've seen two. Right, I've seen three box opens and op openings, and two out of three got um more than 30 full hollows and if that's rate just going off that ratio right there i don't know because right now look it's looking pretty pretty like nasty for me myself so if the full ratio like the how the hollow for the full ratios is like this and almost like you know every fucking three boxes to one then the value on all these cards are going to be shit so they're charging 140 a box which you can go on ebay and buy them for like 80 to uh, like like uh, 100 140 if you really want to but 80 bucks like 89 dollars minimum so you can go on there and buy these fucking boxes for 140 bucks. That's a train charge. That's what I bought one for yesterday. I bought this box for 140. I'm gonna lie because I wanted to open it up now. So, but you can go on eBay and buy them for a lot cheaper. So if people are really buying this. Another reverse. Um, if you're, people are really buying these for 140, then you're gonna in the long run you're losing money. Like if you're just buying them to play the game and look at the cards and stuff like that, or you know you have a channel or something, that's different. But if you're buying them to invest, I would think about that shit. Just say. Yeah, maybe 20 years from now, they'll be worth some fucking money. But I would legit think about that shit, guys. Yeah. Oh, also, the reversal of the iridescent fucking orb. Um, trash. It is a um, one neutral, though. Who's gonna want to put that on there just to attack their own fucking artifact? The other person's not gonna kill it. So we got this black demon, which I don't know how because he's a shark, I guess. So, so whatever. All right, we got Johnny Alvacine, lightning spark. Um, terraforming. This is choice terrors. I think it's a search too. I'm gonna have to read this. I'm sorry. I want to know what this does. So we contract at any time, target BC is placed into its owner's chapter until the end of turn. And until the end of the next turn, that caster may place a BC with the same name or a cost and trace from their chapter onto the so it's fucking you know, okay. You're bringing one back to put one on the field, and then you place the other one back on the field until the next turn. That's pretty sick. So you could pull out like a fucking a cost five for free next turn, and then have a whole fucking board of manager work with. Very, 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 very interesting. Okay, then we got this fucking ape right here. Sasquatch, my bad. Whirling Wimpus. And another full hollow? Okay. Awaken target artifact you control with or across one, two, three, or four. The artifact may not awaken until the end of your turn. Until your next turn, it recovers 10 LP. That is pretty cool. Pretty cool, guys. Pretty cool. I'm loving the artwork on these cards though. Look at that cannonball token. This is so fun. And look at this shit, dude. Look at that shit. Like, what the fuck? Look at this card. Look how shiny and pretty that shit is. That is fucking gorgeous. They did, uh, I'm not gonna lie to look at artwork and, and uh, printing material or whatever you want to call it. The printing fucking, uh, uh, what's the right word for it, babe? 
Mm-hmm. Printing quality has gotten 20 times. Sorry, I'm fucking. I'm smoking, so I'm gonna bring for a little. And I'm tired as fuck. I, went, I haven't. I got home at two o'clock. I got home at twelve. Didn't go back till two, and I went to work today. I had to wake up at four to go to work. So I'm a little tired, but I didn't want to wait to open my box. So I'm. I'm a little right now. Okay. So bear with me. All right. I know y'all want to see this shit. Yeah, I'm keeping that. That's a staple. I'm keeping to the side. I'm gonna go through all these again. So I'm just not gonna worry about that right now, but. Jeez, the cards in this set are ch more than changing the meta. Flight's not gonna mean shit anymore. Flight's a thing in the past. Electric, you're going down, baby. Another full hollow. We got a gargantuan and a water submergence. I, was, I want to read both of these. So. And this does spirit and dark damage. That's pretty cool. You may place this BC and. This beastie and target gargantuan, gargantuan goddess you own in the arena into your chapter. Um, so you, you can only have two in spell, but, but whatever. If the original target of this attack is a beastie with flight, the beastie loses flight until the end of this turn. That's pretty cool. So you're attacking to just fucking knock him down, but 70 would damage kill anything. Unless it's, you know, power of reddit or something. They gave him the red. Hey, what's that fucking drug they use on um Cowboy Bebop? You know, the shit they put in his eye? And you guess how strong? We like the same shit, huh? Go crazy. Okay, the forest element, Riverside Monster, the machine blueprints. Zodiac Dinosaur, Door Star, that'd be nice if you hold it. Um, the Green Guard of Fireball, and another Van Meter Visitor. And we got a Burning Spirit Imprint as the rare non hollow. I'm trying, I want some, I, I'm looking for other cards, you know, I'll, I'll take all these cards, no problem. We got Laser Gun Upgrade. Sam Justy Base, love that. Oh, the star. Holy Beas. Green uh, fireballs. That's actually really squonky. Or squonk. Green charred meteorite reverse. And a food fighter's not hollow. I think it's I think it's food fighters. A fucking food fighter. And this is fear or uh, cosmic and dark. Graze. Phew, phew. This is a duck. <clears throat> Razo Recreation. I wonder why they wanted to have in Razo. The Seven Thunders. Alien Bigfoot. Oh, oh, didn't fuck it up yet. Oh, man, I fucked it up. You haven't seen anything up there. There's Fear of Shadow and UFO. What the fuck? This is a pretty nice card. And more uh, artifacts. Uh, water and I mean, rock and glass. Earth and glass? The rock. Rock solid, baby. Flatwood Monster, that's what it's called. I want the Flatwood Monster. I love that card. That's like my, my fucking wind con in my fucking classic deck. That and a power friend? Oh my god. Oh, these things, they look like lights. These things are disgusting. White Stag. Another reverse. We got a Sunset Finality. Another useless card. I, I honestly think. And the same thing. Same thing as the first one. Useless as fuck. Maybe not. I'll end up using it watch. Where wants artifacts? Squirrel hat. 
Oh, that's wrong. Pocket Dimension Orb. And Tomola as a, as a non holo. See, I, I already filled up in Mola, but I'll take more of those. Because you need four of them. I need a whole place that, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Peace off, man. I'm gonna destroy all tokens, another board wipe, and another hollow. Spirit infusion suit. Looks like Goku. And frozen orb again. That's how useless it is, they keep giving it to you. That's a useless fucking rare. That's a useless one of the useless rares in this set, probably. Yeah, it makes a daylight. He's gonna waste the fucking card just to make a daylight, and then you got to destroy the orb too. That's fucking stupid. And somebody, and you lose 20 life on the side. That part's so dumb. I need, a, I need a drink. I'm parched. <laughs> so I'm not even this part anyway, so it's nothing. I've stopped opening packs and everything. Pack with the blunt in the mouth, fuck it. Yeah. <laughs> Wrong pile. Is it lagging or what? Got a little delay on the camera, sorry. Oh, you saw the reverse already. I don't even know what song is playing. I don't hear it. <laughs> There's no song Steve playing. Oh, we got, look at this guy, Grunch Road Monster. That's pretty cool looking. And we got another reverse. That's cool. It's an artifact that would take it. Lightning. And Food Fighters is the non hollow. Because uh, we take all artifacts. That goes with the full hollows. Yeah, I'm going to reset the thing real quick. So I'm gonna... Something's tripping it out, dude. Delay, whatever. I'm pretty sure you guys see it just fine. Because it looks just fine in my other camera, so. Alright. I think it's the fucking light. For some reason, my. What's going on here? My light's fucking been flickering, so. Oh, look, we got a good one. Oh, I fucking. Oh, man. I'm keeping this as a staple, too. We got Agua. Fucking nice. And a magic engineer's oil. We will be going over all the full hollows. And the uh, small pile of reverse. <laughs> good luck on everybody else on your pulls, though, for sure. Then. Good luck. Good luck. Hope y'all get some magic. Right now, I need more. I need more spirit. More spirit and uh. Oh, what the fuck just happened? Oh, I thought it turned off. I was going to be so pissed. Okay, let me go. Alright. This monster is disgusting as fuck, too, I think. No, it's the one that costs one. We got Evil Twin Swallow Hollow. And Houston Batman. Look at that sunset. That's so pretty. They need to do, like, a... Um, uh, full Hollows for the lands. Like, you know... And there was no box topper either. That's sort of disappointing. Not expecting too much for 140 bucks, man. Fucking box topper. Is that too much to ask?
He's like, no, we gave you hella four hollows. Yeah, but they're gonna drop in value, dude. Especially everybody's buying boxes on eBay for like fucking eighty dollars, nine dollars, hundred bucks. Another Porky the Pig. And another Houston Batman. Leave them all up. We got like six packs left. We're almost done. I'm gonna go through the four hollows real quick. Porky the fucking pig, not one flatwood monster. Another agua. Oh, he has two heads coming out of him. He has one coming out of his mouth. Oh, right. We're almost done. And the next one is... Oh, shit. Level and rocket. Evil Twins is the fucking no hollow. Getting close, man. I need one more. We are almost done. Yeah, we're just gonna go. We got crop circles. We're gonna go straight through these now. There's only got a few left. Another UFO for hollow and casters gun. No hollow. I think those full hollow. They're pretty cool, but nothing like. Oh my god. Take the watch off real quick. All right, we got four packs left. Oh, there's the full hollow. Bam, and we got a protector value monster, Proctor. Okay. There's that full hollow I was talking about. Another gargantuan glider and a wink. Got another winking as the verb as a non hollow. So, this box was actually really good. As in, you know, look at that. That is gorgeous. And Dragon Rise. We got one pack left. We will do the card trick or the pack trick for the last pack. <laughs> One, two, three, four. All right. So the rare token, token, token. All right. We got void potion, hidden templars, robo flowers, top spinner. We got two pies left. Avid, arid rock drought. Uh, one more. Dwarf star, and oh, we got two more. Static cult, and. Reverse opalescent moss. That's nice. All right, now let's count these reverse and let's see how many hot pool we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So that means we got 29 full hollows. That's nice. <laughs> I'm hoping Rudy's box gives me some fire. His box is okay, but it's not really what I wanted. But you can't really bitch complain. Got three of these motherfuckers. You only need one. And you can have ten, four of these birds. I need two more hollow Lincolns. So. Hope you enjoyed the video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe. And hope to see you on the next one.